Hello and thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to show you how to make Thai style rice soup. This dish works great any time of the day, however it's especially good for breakfast or when you're feeling under the weather. We're using shrimp in this recipe, however you could just make rice soup on its own or substitute the shrimp with pork or chicken. This recipe is a great way to use up leftover rice and you should ideally use steamed rice that has been left to cool and is at least one day old. The flavour of this dish is simple and mild and it's very filling and satisfying. On screen now is a list of the ingredients. As always, details on these ingredients will be available on our blog. I'll link to that in the description box below this video. Okay, so let's get started. First, just start by heating two tablespoons of cooking oil in a saucepan until it's very hot. Then add two tablespoons of finely chopped garlic and fry until golden brown. Then remove about half of the garlic and the oil for use as garnishing later. Then add about two cups of water to the saucepan, along with two tablespoons of fish sauce, one tablespoon of soy sauce, and one cup of celery leaves, along with one teaspoon of preserved radish. Give everything a stir and leave until the soup begins to boil. Once the soup is boiling, add about 200 grams of steamed rice that has been left to cool and mix it into the soup. Once the soup starts to simmer again, add 200 grams of shrimp and simmer for about two to three minutes until the shrimp is pink and cooked. Finally, garnish with half a teaspoon of pepper, some ginger, spring onion and coriander, as well as the fried garlic oil we saved earlier, and then serve and enjoy. So we hope you enjoyed our rice soup recipe. Next time you're wondering what to do with your leftover rice, be sure to give this recipe a try. And if you're interested in seeing more Thai and Asian inspired recipes, do subscribe to our channel. We've got lots more recipes still to come. So thanks once again for watching and we hope to see you again on the next video.